Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, be back with you once again for another edition of The Price is Right, right here at MVG Productions. Glad you could join me here once again. This time around, we've got some more pricing games to play and a lot of fun, and I'm not alone this one. I will not be playing. I have a few friends in the audience that will be joining us here, playing as, serving as my contestants. It's the cast and crew here at MVG Productions. Say hello, everyone. Oh, Hi. Hello. Uh, yeah. What's good? Yo. Yeah, there, there's there's a lot of them. I, I, I go listen through them all, but I'm like, we'd be here all afternoon. But you guys, <laughs> you guys came for a game. They came to play. So let's waste no more time and let's jump right into it. Y'all ready? Ready. ready. Yes. Yep. All right. Chewy, punch it. Let's play The Price is Right. Here it comes. From the MVG Production Studios and Cyberspace, television's most exciting hour of fantastic prizes, it's time for the fabulous 60 Minute Price is Right! Alright, each of my contestants have two seats in the audience, so they get they each have two chances to try to come on stage and play. Starting with Aaron first, come on down! <laughs> Alright, who's next? Lawrence, come on down! Yay! Next up is... Danny, come on down! And who's gets, who gets the majestic green spot to start off? Jose, come on down! And and you guys are the first four contestants today on The Price is Right! All right, remember guys, you only have 13 seconds to bid. You gotta be as close to the actual retail price as you can without going over. You win, you get to come up on stage to play a pricing game. Here's your first time up for bids. It's a Carson's five-piece dining group. It's a beautiful dining room group there. All right, Aaron, we're gonna start with you. What do you bid? 1,200. 1,200, good bid there. Lawrence? 1,250. 1,250. All right, Danny? Uh, 999. 999, you disagreeable German, you. And Jose? <laughs> Sorry, Danny. Thousand dollars, Vivis. And making friends early on. I see it now. <laughs> Actual retail price of the dining room group is twenty-eight hundred dollars. Uh -oh. Lawrence, get up here! Yay! Wow, a rare chance for an exacta. I'm contesting for real. Didn't happen today. Lawrence, you're the first one to put you on stage today. You ready to play a good pricing game, sir? Hopefully. Well, here's what you're playing for. It's a new car! Yeah. The Pontiac Hello. G8. Comes with standard features, California emissions, sun roof package, and, and te leather interior. It's the Pontiac G8. All right, you're playing high-low, sir. Here's, your, here's some items for you. We have the Ester C supplement, uh, vitamin C supplement. They have a Brute Revolutionary spray, spray cologne. A 16-ounce pack of Laura's Lane ground beef. A... A uh, Brickford hard salami. Mm -hmm. We have a package of CoverGirl mascara, and finally, we have a 105 count package of Cottonelle disinfecting wipes, lemon scent. All right, we're playing the one of the cla old school games here on the price. Right, we're playing high low. All you got to do is pick out the three highest price prices up there. If you could do that. And the other three prices are the low, lower than the lowest price in your high row. You're a winner, and you're driving away in a brand new car, sir. So, when you are ready, uh, pick an I pick the items that you think are the most expensive up there. Okay, uh, let's. We allowed uh, to help. Uh, it's the price is right. Of course you can. I go with the mascara. Lawrence. You can give him all the advice you want, but it's up to him to decide if he wants to take it or not. Well, let's go with the supplement. The vitamin C? All right, the 100, yeah. the 120 count um, vitamin supplement. How much is that one? That one is 1409. I'd say that's a good one. Uh, 
Mas the mascara. The mascara. Let's see. How much for the CoverGirl mascara? That one is 809 I think you're good there. One more. Spray cologne. In the, in the cologne. The cologne? Yep. All right. The cologne is... Ten thirty-five. All right. So the CoverGirl mascara is the lowest price. So these other three have to be less than eight oh nine. You're a winner. Ground beef, eight sixty-five. Uh, uh, oh wow! No, the mascara was actually the lowest one up there. You should have yeah. went with this. You should have went with the salami, sir, and you'd have been a winner. That's all right. You'll spin the big wheel in just a minute. For now, we're gonna say, Mitch, come on down. You're the next contestant on the all Price right, is right. All right. All right. Oh, Mitch. All right. All right, Mitch, here's a chance for you. Let's see what we're bidding on. Oh, it's a collection of Martex towels. Accentuate your bathroom with this beautiful collection of Martex towels. Mitch, you're, you just got called on down. You get to bid first. Five ninety-five. Okay. Five ninety-five. Okay, Danny. Uh, seven fifty. Seven hundred fifty dollars, Jose. Eight hundred. Eight hundred dollars, and Aaron. Hate to be that guy, but eight oh one. Eight oh one. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Turnabout is fair play, oh. and the actual retail price of that collection of towels is eight twenty six. Aaron off by a quarter. <laughs> Dang Not it, bad. Aaron. Sorry, Jose. <laughs> Yeah. See, that's karma coming back to you on that one, Jose. I mean, I'm just saying. Because you, you were the first one to one-up somebody, so. All right, Aaron, welcome to the stage, sir. You're going to play a fun pricing game. That's a classic one they don't play anymore. Super Saver. You're playing for a pirate ship bed. That should be fun. Here's some grocery items for you. We have a set of Nico candy buttons, a back package of Pine Brothers throat drops. We have a can of Alita wrinkle cream. We have an 8.4 ounce bottle of Edge Extra Moisturizing Shaving Gel. We have a Conair Shower Cap Terry Lime. And finally, we have a can of Ships Ahoy Red Salmon. Now this is super saver. You, you like going to the grocery store. You like saving money, don't you, of course? Yeah, who doesn't? All right, that's, that's, that's the concept behind this game. We have six grocery items. Each of them have a price tag on them. Some could be above the, some could be priced above the actual retail price. Some could be, most are probably priced below. Your objective is to pick four items here, and try to save at least one dollar and change. If you can do that, you're walking away with that pirate's bed worth over three thousand dollars. All right. So try to pick the items that you think you could save the most money on. And you get to pick four, and you have to save at least a dollar. Okay, uh, let's start with the cough drops. All right, the cough drops, okay. Those are priced at $3.89. Actual retail price for $39, you save 50 cents. Good start, sir. Do that three more times, you're a winner. All right, let's go to the, the Edge Gel. The Edge Shaving Gel, all right. Priced at two dollars and eighty-five cents. The actual retail price three fifteen. You just save thirty cents more. All right, you are up to eighty cents, sir. You're twenty cents away from the dollar target, but you have to pick two more items. Okay, um, the wrinkle cream. Yeah, the Alita wrinkle cream. Priced at ninety-nine cents. I think you're saving money here. Let's see, actual retail price. A dollar thirty-nine. That's forty cents. Say that's a dollar twenty. Now all you have to do is not lose more than twenty cents on this last product, and you are a winner, sir. Okay. Um, the shower cap. The shower cap. All right. The shower cap is the worst case scenario. We want to see it, nothing below two dollars and eighty-nine cents. If you do, you're a winner. It's priced at three oh nine. Actual retail price of the shower cap. 369, you save 60 cents, you're a winner. <laughs> Look at you almost saving double the money. Nicely done. Good job, Aaron. Sailing off to Dreamland in his new pirate bed. Enjoy that, sir. We're going back to contestants row, and we're going to find ourselves another contestant. And that is going to be Sean. Come on down. 
You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. All right, looking good so far. All right, Sean could be bidding first on this. A Lane Country Living Wash Stand. All right, so it's a nice, like, country-style sink you can put in your bathroom or kitchen if you'd like. All right, Sean, what do you bid? Nine seventy-five. Nine seventy-five seems like a good bit there, Mitch. Eleven fifty. Eleven hundred fifty dollars. Okay, Danny. Okay. Let's go with just one thousand. One thousand dollars, babies, and Jose. Twelve hundred. Twelve hundred dollars. All right. And the actual re never mind, you've all overbid. <laughs> all right, lowest all right, lowest okay. bids nine seventy five. Erase the bids, please. Go lower than nine seventy five, Sean. Seven seventy five. Seven seventy five. All right. Mitch. Eight hundred. Eight hundred dollars. Danny? Uh one dollar. One dollar. <laughs> and Jose. Um Eight fifty. How much? Eight fifty. Eight fifty. Okay. The actual retail price of the country wash stand four oh nine. Giddy up, Danny. Come on on the stage. Wow, are you kidding me? <laughs> had had Jose, Danny not hit that dollar, he would have all over bid again. Jose, I thought you were gonna pay two dollars. I I thought he was too. I'm gonna lie, but all right, Danny worked out for you, and now you're gonna get a chance to play for a trip to Italy. Ooh. I wouldn't one up you twice, Danny. You want to guess the fly round trip coach from Los Angeles to beautiful Capri, Italy for a six night stay? But wait, that's not all. You also play for a new car. Oh my god. The Volvo V70. And you can win them both playing Radical. Ooh. All right, so you have a chance to win that trip to Italy, the Volvo, and possibly $10,000 in cash if you know something about these items over here on the Radical podium. All right, starting off with, we have a smoothie maker here. Price tag on it is $54. Is that price true or false? I'll say true. He says true. Is that a $54 smoothie maker? It is. Very good. You get one spin of the Radical Wheel. I'll explain how it works in a minute. Let's see if you can earn four more spins here. Next, we have a Rival Cool Metal Four Slice Toaster priced at $55. True or false? Let's go with false. False. I don't think a toaster's $55, is it? Yeah, it's $67. Wow. That's an expensive toaster. toaster there. All right. Next, we have a Polka Dot Hair Dryer priced at $74. True or false? I get the, I think I get the polk item right, Brandon. All right, let's go with, uh, let's go with false. He says false there. What's the price? No, oh, that one was true. All right. Let's see if you can earn another spin here. We have a disco ball lamp, priced at fourteen dollars. Let's say true. Say it's true on that one. It is. All right, it's true. And finally, the Duracraft vaporizer, priced at twenty-nine dollars. False. It says false on the vaporizer. It is. It's 17. Wow. Four spins, sir. Well done. All right. Four spins of the radical wheel here is what you've got. Now, here's the way we work. We're gonna, when you tell me to, we're going to spin this wheel. Whatever it stops on, if it lands on one of the prizes, that's yours to keep. However, at any point in time, if you land on a space that says nothing on there, you, you not only win nothing, but you lose any of the prizes you've accumulated up to that point. At any point in time, you could stop and take the prizes you've won and walked away, but if you can ma manage to land on that magical golden space on the wheel that says win it all, you win the, ca you win the car, you win the trip, and you get $10,000 in cash on top of it for a grand total of over $55,000 up for grabs in this one, all right? So when you feel lucky, just let me know when to spin this wheel, and we'll see what comes up. Good luck to you. And you can spin it now. All right. First spin of the radical wheel is away. Oh, just clicked off the cash there. Unfortunately, nothing yet, but you still got three more spins. You can try again. All right, let's do it now. There you go. Next spin. Want to give him a prize. 
Be nice, wheel. And he's got... He got the trip. All right, you got that trip to Italy. Uh, again, six nights at the Luxury Hotel the, for the Grotta Azura Tour. You could take that trip to Italy, stop now, or you can spin again, realizing if you land on a nothing this time, you're going to lose that trip to Italy. What do you want to do? Let's try one more. All right, tell me when. And uh, go ahead. All right, risking the trip to Italy on this spin here, looking to maybe either pile some cash or a new car with it. And, oh, just missed the Ooh. win at all. All right, you got one spin left. You don't have any prizes. Uh, let's, we might as well go for it. Good luck, man. Hope you win it all Thank here. Thank you. All right, go ahead and spin. There it is. Final spin. So determine what he goes home with. Come on, win it all. Come on, win it all. Here it comes. Oh, he got the cash. That's good. That's good. All right, not bad, sir. That's it. You just got yourself $10,000 of cash. Well done. All right, put that in the bank and enjoy that. Well, we just got through spinning the radical wheel. Now let's go spin the big wheel because it's time for our first showcase showdown. All right, here's the three players so far this episode. Quick math says we've given away over $17,000. Not bad, not bad for the first half. Uh, remember, you get uh, one a tr objective here, of course, to try to get a dollar and one spin on a combination of two spins for $1,000. If you do, you get a chance for a bonus spin where you can win up to an additional $25,000. Yeah. All right. Lawrence, you're up first, sir. So when you're ready, just say spin. Spin. And that is a very soft spin. Yeah. I, will that get around twice? If it gets to the nickel, it's a good spin. It is. Will he get the dollar? No. Me. Ouch. The bare minimum. You got a five cent, sir. I assume you'd like to spin again. Ouch. Please. All right. Pain. Maximum finish. Hopefully. Almost maximum finish. Yeah. Nickel in his first spin. He doesn't want to see a dollar now. Here comes 95. He's got a chance for a dollar. 95. Can it get down here? Got it! Yes. One dollar! Whoa! Well done. Yeah. Thousand dollars for you. You're gonna get a bonus spin here in just yeah. a minute. All right, Aaron. He has set the bar at maximum height. You gotta match it, sir. Your turn. All right, spin. All right. Dollars the score he's got to beat, and your first spin up is going to be. Middle number, 65 cents. So you have to spin again. You need 35. All right. Let's spin for the 35. There it goes. Money. Um, There goes the 35, unfortunately. And you are definitely in the wrong part of town, Aaron. I'm sorry. Sure. But you still got one more chance in the audience, so maybe you get back up here. We'll see what happens here. Danny, our top winner so far, over $10,561 in cash and prizes. Yeah. When you're ready, sir. All right, let's do it. Come on, Danny. <laughs> First spin for Danny up. He is going to have, looks like he might have to do this the hard way. 95 cents, sir. Only yeah, one, sp one space saves you right now. You need the nickel. Uh, let's go ahead. <laughs> Will he get the magical green nickel? There it goes. It might have enough to get back around here. Here it comes. Here it comes. Will he get oh the nickel? Boy. Will we have a tie? Tie? No! Oh, it gosh. held up right before it, sir. I'm so sorry. Oh, man. Enjoy the money, though. You might get another chance to get back here on stage. That is messed up. All right, Lawrence. You're going on to the showcase, sir, but now you got a chance for that bonus spin. you got to make sure it gets all the way around at least twice. Otherwise, it doesn't count. You don't get to spin again. Remember, green sections are worth $10,000 apiece. If you land on it, you land on the dollar again, worth $25,000. Good luck to you. Okay. Spin. Good spin. <coughs> it's around twice. 
There goes the money section, and I don't think it's going to make it back around here again. But, hey, well, not bad, so, sir. Another $1,000 in cash. You're over four grand so far on this episode. Yeah. Oh, 3800 excuse me, this episode. And you're going on the showcase. So we'll see you at the end of the show. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to give somebody else a chance to see who's going to be facing Lawrence in that showcase. If Lawrence's name comes back up, we'll take him out of the audience there and we'll place him with somebody else. To make it fair, and we'll see who we got. Jose, come on down, or just stand between the yellow and green podiums. That works too. You got two chances, Jose, and you're going to be bidding first on two Garmin GPS units. All right, Jose, you're up, sir. You get two bids. Yoo-hoo, Jose, over here. Yep, max bid on the first one. He's muted. <laughs> yeah, but not looking good. All right, it's going to be double max bid. Sean, you're up, sir. Let's go 700 $700. I think Jose might have to step away for a minute. And Mitch. 701 701. Nah. Wow. <laughs> Let's see. The, never mind. You've overbid. Nah. Okay. All right. Uh, so we'll raise the bids. Go lower than 700. Jose, you get another chance if you're there. I think you might have gone somewhere. Yeah. It would have been nice to just get a heads up, but that's uh, all right. Nothing happening there. All right, so we'll max bid him on both. Uh, Sean, think about your bid. Hold up, I'm back. All right, quickly, GPS units. 500. 500. Uh, not in time, sir. Sorry, Sean? 350. About 350, okay. Let's see what you did there. Mitch? 375. 375. Being nice and giving him some cushion this time. Actual retail price of the GPS units, six sixty nine. Mitch, get up here. So mm -hmm. All right. Nicely done, sir. Got a couple GPS units coming your way. But let's see if we can get you a nicer price to play for. You're going to be playing a classic around here. Time for the old punch board. We're playing punch a bunch for a chance of $25,000 in cash. Right, you get a chance to earn up to four punches at the old punch board if you can tell me something about these items over here. Starting with a Sultan popcorn maker, priced at $26. Uh, is the right price higher or lower than $26? Higher. You say higher, and that is higher. You're right. You got one punch. All right. Uh, next, we have a multi blade pizza cutter, priced at $171. What do you say there? Lower. Yeah, you can say lower than that. I don't think it'd be that much. Oh, one hundred and ninety dollars. Yeah. My goodness. Wow. Season? That's an expen that's an expensive pizza cutter to say. All right, let's try this one. We have a Kodak Pocket video camera, one hundred eighty nine dollars, sir. Lower. Come on, be lower. One eighty. There you go. Two punches for you, and finally. We have the Magnavox Universal VCR and DVD bracket. Priced $43. Higher or lower than $43? Higher. It says higher than $43. It is $30. Oh. All right. You got two punches, sir. That's a chance at possibly $25,000. All right. Just tell me which holes you want to punch out. We're do, we do this uh, sort of... Um, Battleship style. Uh, the rows going down are A through E. The rows going, uh, the columns going across are one through ten. So just call out your coordinates. We'll punch out the holes. See how well you do. Okay, let's do C seven. C seven. That would be this one. One more. And B three. B3. All right. Good luck. First hole that you punched out, you've won yourself. $250. All 
All right, one of the lower amounts up there, there are 10, 28, 30. There are 35 cards on the board that are worth more than that. Keep the 250 or give it back and try for the other one. Let's see. Let, uh, let's continue. Let's All go. right, go on for it. Good luck. Hope it's a big one. You gave up $250, and in turn, you've won yourself 500 All right, you doubled your money. Not bad, sir. You won. Yeah. You doubled up 500 bucks for you, and you're going to get a chance to spin the big wheel here in just a minute. By the way, big money, D8. D8 mm. was the $25,000. So you were one off diagonally, sir. Well, thank you. All done. All right. We need another contestant down here. Who's it going to be? Mitch, come on, man. <laughs> come on back now. <laughs> you getting a reprieve, sir. Another chance. All right. All right, Jose, you you get ready to bid here in a minute. Uh, Mitch, you're going to start off by bidding on this Ridgeway Charlotte Grandfather Clock. All right, Mitch, what's your bid? 1600 1600 okay. Jose, you get two bids. The first bid will be $1,000. $1,000, okay. And the second one? And the second one will be twelve fifty. Twelve fifty. All right. And Sean. Thirteen and a quarter. Thirteen and a quarter, he says. All right. The actual retail price of that grandfather clock is thirty-two fifty-two. Mitch, get on back up here again. Sure will. Here I come. He just running up and down the stairs at this point. Exactly. Getting his yeah. cardio in. That's all right. No shame in that. All right. Welcome back to the show, and now you're going to get a chance to play for this. All right, play a magic number, a classic game here. All right, all you have to do is give me what the magic number that falls between these two prizes. If you can do that, you win them both. Simple as that. Uh, the, you want a number that is higher than a price of the best Miller Living Room Group, but lower than the Golf Video Arcade game. So we got a living room group and a, a golf arcade game. Give me a number that you think falls between those two. I'll try to get the magic number as close as I can to that for you. Uh. Audience, feel free to help him out. Mm. Yeah, again, a number higher than the price of the living room group, yet lower than the price of an arcade game. Oh, yeah. See, I have I have a number in mind, but unfortunately, I can't help you. I'm the only one that can't. <laughs> um, I go two thousand, but don't. Don't count on that. I'd say 2,300. <laughs> but don't quote me. I got some advice there. Go with those or come up with something of your own, sir. But I do need a number. 2,250. 2,250. All right. 2,250. Let's see if I can get it close here. Dang it. How about 2249? That's good. That's good. Cool with that, or you want to go higher or lower from there? That's about as close as I can get it. Let's go a little bit higher. A little, a little bit. higher? Yeah. That's good. That's good. 2265? Okay. Yeah, that's good. All right. Well, let's see if it's a win the winning magic number. Is it lower than the price of the arcade game? Yes, it is. Is it mm. higher than the price of the living room group? Mm. It is not. Mm. Unfortunately, sorry. Wow. So, yep, yeah, my number would have worked. I was thinking 35. All right, but you, you get another chance to spin the wheel, and we got room for one more contestant. Aaron, come on back down. <laughs> 
And I'm going to give one other person, Jose, a chance. So we're going to take away this spot here for you. And give one more contestant a chance to come up. And Lawrence, get up here. All right. It is our final pricing game yeah. of the day. So we're going to see if somebody can get up here. Our item is, we have a Largo Retin-A Queen Bed with Sleep Set. Last chance for the be a bid. Aaron, what do you bid on that? Um, 34 25 34 25 Alright, Jose? Um, 3000 $3,000. Okay, Lawrence? Uh... Dirty, dirty three fifty. Thirty three fifty. And Sean. Nineteen seventy. Nineteen seventy. I think that was Good the year, year my brother was born. Actual retail price twenty eight ninety. Sean, <laughs> with, oh, the yeah. with the low bids, a winner. Dang <laughs> it. Good, Good, try. Good try, everybody else. Uh, we got some parting gifts for the rest of the audience. Sean. You're going to get yourself a chance up here. And you are going to play for a new car! <laughs> the Cadillac STS V Edition. Couple of standard features. California Mission. Window and Tint Package 4A. It's the Cadillac STS. Valued at $78,451. That is an expensive car you have a chance to win, sir. And all you got to do to win it is spell the word car. Playing, we're playing oh. the classic spelling bee here. All right. Ah. You get two. Uh, uh, up on the board, we have cards, each with letters behind them. C, A, R. Two of them actually say the word car. You get two picks okay. for free to start. So go ahead and pick me two numbers between 1 and 30. Okay. Let's go for. Yeah. Let's go for actually, let's go for my birthday, actually, for those two numbers. <laughs> Which would be. Uh, 10 for October, and the day I was born, the 7th. All so right, seven 10 and, and ten. 7. Okay. All right, those are those two cars. Now you get a chance to earn up to three more if you can tell me the prices of these items over here. Starting with a Black & Decker 10-cup drip coffee oh, yeah. maker and clock. All right. Okay. I'm sorry, say that. Say it's, that again. It's a Black & Decker 10-cup drip coffee maker and clock. Now, within okay. $10 of the price... What do you think the actual retail price of it is? If you're within 10, you get another pick of the board. If you get the number exactly on the nose, you get all three picks. Okay. Black and Decker. It's a 10 cup um, coffee I'll, maker, essentially. I'll say 25. 25, say $25. $25 for that. What's the right price? $42. You're off ah. by 17, so no pick there. Try again with this one. It is an interbath all directional chrome shower head. Oh, an interbath all directional chrome shower head within ten dollars. How much for the shower head? I'll say thirty. Thirty dollars for that. All right, at retail price thirty-nine. Off by nine. That's, that's good. Just made it within ten. All right, pick another number for me. Okay, let's go for number fifteen, please. Fifteen. All right, and finally we have uh, the album Rattle and Hum by U2 on CD for you. How much for the U2 CD? I oh, know that's not going to be very much, I don't think. I'll say... 10. 10 bucks? 10. 10 dollars? All 10 right. Bucks. 10 bucks for the CD, actual retail price. 19, you're within 10. There you go. Woo. All right, one more pick of the board, sir. 23 skidoo. 23 it shall be. All right, now each of those cards that you just picked are worth $1,000 in consolation cash to you. You can forget about driving out of here in a caddy and take $4,000, or I'll turn over the first card and see what you've, you've got so far. Hmm. I do want me a caddy. I do want me a caddy. Mine's, mine's me and my grandfather. <laughs> God bless mm -hmm. his soul. Um, let's, 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 flip, let's flip the card. All right. First card is a C. All right. You can take $3,000 and stop, or I'll flip over the next one. Uh, let's flip the next one, please. All right. 
Second card is an A. Okay. Now the breakdown yeah. of the, the breakdown on the board, I should tell you, there are eleven C's up there. There's eleven A's, six R's, and two cars that say the word car. So you can take two thousand dollars or hope that one of these next two cards has an R or the car on it. Your choice. Um I'll go. Hmm. Going on, look, looking for an R. The third one is a C. Last chance, sir. Take $1,000 and walk away or flip it and hope that that's a winner. What do you want to do? All or nothing. Let's go for it. Good luck. Please be an R or a car. Last card is an A. Ah! <laughs> Let's see. Let's look at oh, the board. Well. Where were the car cards at? Number nine and number fourteen were the car cards. And unfortunately, you're all around the R's, but couldn't find one there. But there's right. the board line up there. But you're gonna get a chance to spin the big wheel because it's time for our second of our two showcase showdowns. Mitch, you get two chances here to try to get to the showcase. So you're up first. Get it. All right. Remember, close closest to one dollar without going over gets to the showcase. Get a dollar, you get a thousand dollars, and a chance to play for another twenty-five. And Mitch, you got a starting score of eighty-five. How do you feel about that? Hey, I'm gonna stay. Okay, you're gonna stay with eighty-five. All right, Sean, you're up. You gotta be eighty-five cents, sir. I thought he said he wants. He goes twice. He does, but uh, the way no, the, the way the way his scores line up here, he actually won the least and the most. So that means he spins first and last. So that means you get to spin exactly. second. Okay, let's spin about the mid the midpoint. <laughs> yeah, he said spin. Unfortunately, that is kind of a low spin. I don't. That might get all the way around. Yep, that's a legal spin, and you got fifty. So okay. you have to spin again. You need at least thirty-five. All right. All right, spin it. There we go. That's a good spin there. Looking for 50 or less. It's anything between 35 and 50. Here comes 35 for a tie. 35, 35, 35. And it's over. I'm sorry, Sean. All right, Mitch, you're going on, okay. the, you're going on the showcase, but you get a chance to see if you can't earn that dollar. Good, good luck to you. Good luck, Mitch. Yeah. Hit it. All right, Mitch doing the victory lap now. See if he can get that dollar. And he's got a shot on this one. It's going to be close. Uh, I think he overshot it, though. Yep, one more time, sir. You're starting with 80 on this one. You need a 20. Yep. Hit it. All right, there it is. Will he get the 20 cents? It's going to have enough. It's going to be close. Will it get, have enough to get down here? I think not. But, no. yeah, double 80. That's not going to work for sure. I'm going to the showcase, though. <laughs> yeah, you got it, though. You're off the showcase with your 1389. Some prizes you won there. So it is Lawrence taking on Mitch in the showcase, and that's coming up in just a second. All right, showcase time here with uh, Mitch and Lawrence. Remember, if you're the winner and less than $250 away from your actual retail price of your showcase, you get both showcases, all right? So good luck. Lawrence, you're the top winner, so you get the option to bid on this first showcase or pass it to Mitch. Here it comes. We start with an LG 52-inch DLP TV, a trip to St. Thomas, six nights at Bluebeard's Castle, a Samsung 13.3-inch notebook computer with 120 gigabyte solid state drive, an Ashley Martini suite with Dining Room Group, a Geet Sofa from our friends at HighBrownFurniture.com, and a Garia Luxury Golf Cart. And that showcase can be yours if the price is right. You want to bid on it or you would like to pass? Mitch. Pass it. All right, going to pass. All right, Mitch, that's your showcase, sir. Take a second. What? Tell me what your bid is. Twenty one thousand seven. Twenty one thousand seven hundred dollars. Is that your final answer? Yeah. Final answer? 
No, 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 no. No, change it. All right. All right. What's your bid? Twenty-two thousand fifty dollars. Twenty-two thousand fifty dollars. Is that your final yeah. answer? Yes. Okay. Yes. There it is. It's locked in. Lawrence, here comes your showcase. Okay. Uh, your showcase features a start with a trip to Rome, six nights at the Balsalo Resort, a Carson's Contemporary Sofa, a china cabinet with a cherry finish, and if that wasn't enough for you, how about this? A new car! Yeah. The Saturn Astra XR two-door hatchback. It's a nice looking car. I haven't seen any Saturns on the road in a while. And that showcase can be yours if the price is right. Alright, somewhat of a small showcase, but a very valuable one though, sir. What's your bid? Uh, $24,350. $24,350. Final answer? Yes. Got it in. All right, let us see who is today's winner on this one. Good luck. We're going to start off with, I think Mitch goes first. He does. All right, Mitch, you bid $22,050 in your showcase, sir. And I'm here to tell you the actual retail price of your showcase is $38,206. That's a difference of $16,156. Lawrence, you got to come closer than sixteen one fifty six in order to win. All right, Lawrence, you bid twenty four thousand three fifty. The audience is still stunned by that bid. Actual retail price of your showcase is thirty three thousand eight sixty seven for a difference of nine thousand five seventeen. Lawrence, you are today's winner. GG. Well played, sir. $37,667 is what you've won today, sir. Nicely done. Congratulations to you. Congratulations to all of our contestants for playing the prices right today. But that's going to do it for us, guys. Thank you so much for watching this episode. If you like what you see and want to see more of it, check out the full prices right playlist here on the channel. If you want to subscribe and see all the other great game shows we play here, click that subscribe button down below and ring the bell. That way you never miss out on all the fun and games going down here at MVG Productions. And until the bidding wars begin once again, I'm your host, Brandon Scruggs, reminding you that we've won $60,069 on today's show. And to help control the pet population, have your pets spayed and neutered, and help control the virus population, wash your face, wash your hands, wash your ass. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. <laughs> Peace. <laughs> Bye.